Hi guys, it's David James from Business Growth Digital Marketing and in this video I want to talk to you about how you can monetize your website by placing ads from the media.net network. So this is a network that's leveraged by Bing and by Yahoo. Uh, I've tested it in the past, I no longer use this platform but I want to show you how you can actually use this platform in order to try to, try to monetize your website. So I'm going to jump into my console and I've pulled up a report uh, from one of the campaigns that I ran. So I worked with uh, media.net uh, probably for about a year and I tried it out to see if I could actually make some revenue from it. Now in the first couple of months it was quite encouraging. So uh, here the blue line you can see this is the revenue and the line below is the amount of impressions. Now, the site that I was testing it on was my digital nomad site, which is called lolivia.com. And the site at the time, it wasn't getting that many impressions, but despite the amount of impressions that it was getting, it was still making some revenue. So in January, you can see that it's got zero, but then in February, it made roughly around a dollar, and then the month after, roughly around one dollar as well. But then what happened uh, the month after was it just dropped and the revenue just dropped completely across the board despite getting the same or even more impressions. So in December of 2016, I decided to uh, finish uh, with them. But I can see how people make money using an ad network like media.net. So I'm going to scroll down so you can see more of the statistics. So in this column, you can see uh, the impressions and you can see the revenue per thousand and you can see the estimated revenue. So at the bottom, the total says that I would have made about $2.27 and that is from the first couple of months of actually running the campaign with media.net. Everything else really didn't make any money. So, you know, it's a bit unfortunate. Now, usually with uh, advertising platforms, there's a cap that you need to make in order to withdraw the money that you made. Now, because my total is so low, I'm not going to be able to withdraw it. Uh, so I'm not going to be able to get that money. Now, if your site has hundreds or thousands of impressions every day, then it's likely that you will be able to make more money over time. And then you'll be able to withdraw that money and earn an income from your website. Then if you have multiple websites and you replicate the system, then you can make more money. Now, one of the other reasons that I decided not to pursue media.net was I didn't like the way the ads looked on my site. So for me, it just doesn't look that professional. It only provides text-based ads, whereas compared with AdSense, uh, they can also provide uh, image ads or display ads. Uh, with graphics so it actually makes your site look a lot more professional if that's the kind of look you want to give on your website. So because of those reasons I didn't really want to pursue uh, media.net uh, but I can see how it does make money for, um, for different websites. So if you're looking to monetize your site you can consider media.net see if it works for you and if it does that's great you know, keep on trying to make more money from it uh, if not, you can try something else, but it's definitely something that you can consider as a part of your website monetization strategy. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you do have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. If you liked the video, don't forget to hit like, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll speak to you next time.